story of the young man, profoundly deaf, who was robbed of the very equipment he needs to communicate with the rest of the world. He'd been walking through a Vancouver park when he was knocked unconscious, and his rent money, phone, a special laptop that he needs for his schooling, and even his hearing aids were stolen. Well, since our story, there's been an overwhelming response from News Hour viewers. And tonight, the final chapter has a very happy ending. All right, Derek, how's my voice now? It's, it's pretty okay. It's kind yeah. of like up there, but muffled. Okay, so do you want it louder? Louder, yeah. Okay. Derek is getting his life back. He can hear again. The 21-year-old is being fitted for new hearing aids after he was brutally beaten and robbed. I'm really happy right now just to be able to hear again. So I'm happy to have my life. I'm happy to be here. The Vancouver Film School student was jumped on the downtown east side Saturday night. On my back of my shoulder, you can see this marking. Derek, who is profoundly deaf, was knocked unconscious and covered in cuts and bruises. His phone, rent money, and laptop containing a 40-page film script were stolen, along with his independence. Derek's $4,000 hearing aids were ripped right out of his ears.